Here's question number five. What's the difference between acupuncture and Asian herbs? I'll read that off to you from here. Acupuncture is used for treatment of pain, inflammation, neuropathy, hormonal imbalance, such as hot flashes, and drug withdrawal. Well, herbs also do the same. It's just that acupuncture will be the first to use because often enough, it is enough to address all of these without needing to use the herbs. Now with the herbs, they are used to reverse diseases and optimize your health as a tonic. Asian herbs are plants that have been used for thousands of years with ample amount of clinical experience. Asian herbs reverse organ and gland dysfunctions. They also help the mind and quality of functioning. They are like good quality foods on steroids. So these Asian herbs are broken down into two main things that they do. One is that they reverse internal diseases that are related to organs, glands, and, and uh, physiology. And the other is that it's a tonic. Tonic means is that it promotes health in multiple ways and it increases your well-being. And so then you have a higher quality of living and you have longevity. So the herbs do both. It treats diseases and it also enhances or optimizes your internal function. And for the internal, herbs are better usage than the acupuncture is or acupuncture does. And so you could think of herbs as a very strong form of food. And when it is applied correct for your body type, then it works with your body for your body to self-heal multiple things. And not only that, it helps to establish homeostasis within so that things work more optimally. So you have an optimal health for your age. So think of something like uh, teenagers. They're, they have boundless energy. They're focused, they have clarity, and their internal system is more integrated, and they don't really go to sleep at night because they're tired, but they go to sleep because they're more sleepy. And so that's the type of optimization, not in exact that way, but optimization for where you're at on your timeline.